Uh, Shalom, I'm Akim. This is your brother Karab from GMS Miami. Uh, first and foremost, want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakal Kadash. Um, double honor to the elder apostles, great millstone, which are the top teachers on earth today, as far as the Bible is concerned. Um, greetings, love, and blessings to all you sincere Akim throughout the four corners of the earth that push the unadulterated truth of the Bible and risk your lives to do so. Okay, um, this is um, the verse of the day. Okay, and it's basically the inspiration uh, for this verse is, um, you know, basically seeing um, the Most High is, is, <laughs> is manifest in His Word, man. You know, we we in the la uh, last seconds of this thing, and the um, the Heavenly Father is, is 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 beginning to show His face, man. You know, with um. All the things that are going on uh, in world news, you know, <laughs> local news, you know, niggas, niggas uh, being niggas, uh, being more, uh, show, uh, exuding more monkey business, so to speak. Um, you know, the op opioid crisis turning up basically on Esau and, and, and crackers overdosing, you know. So, yeah, man, just, just everything being in turmoil, which... Uh, Basically, it was prophesied, man. But it, it, it's beginning with uh, the lies, the so-called uh, uh, the lies the so-called white man has uh, uh, propagated on the whole world, you know. And he's being exposed. And and the reason he's being exposed is because there's a higher power, okay. And like the scriptures say, how are the things are Esau sought up? All right, because uh, the Most High and His angels see everything, and the Most High. Always before he destroys a civilization or a rulership, he reveals his secrets to the servants, his prophets. So that's how it's, uh, you know, being sought out. Okay. So I'm going to jump into the verse. Uh, this is um, this is Isaiah 25 and 7. Isaiah 25, 7 and 8. It says, and he will destroy in this mountain the face of the covering cast over all people and the veil that uh, that is spread over all nations. Okay. And that, that veil is, uh, you know, the, uh, just the, um, you know, the trickery and the lies and the deceit that the so-called white man, uh, leads with, you know, he's deceitful. He is the devil that the Bible speaks of the so-called white race. Okay. Um, and cause the word sim devil simply means deceiver and nobody has been more deceptive than the white race. Okay. Um, so um, what's happening is uh, the Most High is, is doing away with that shit, man, you know, because uh, the so-called white man, first and foremost, perceives himself to be the Most High and to, to be all the nations. <laughs> you know, they do these films and uh, you, you have white actors uh, being portrayed as Israelites, as, as the last samurai, you know. <laughs> so he, he's basically, he, you know, in his eyes, he's all the predominant people that have ever ruled in history, you know. So what's and what's happening is the Most High put His Spirit on His men to uh, basically destroy uh, the things that um, you know that He's he, the, the lies that He's pushing on the whole world. Okay, even His allies are becoming uh, are starting to look at Him sideways. You know, so yeah, man, this this thing is uh this thing is uh coming coming to an end, and the reason why is because the Most High is lifting up the skirt of the so-called white man and removing that covering cast. Which is, uh, you know, just a few key words uh, about it is uh, democracy is one of them. Um, you know, um, race, uh, uh, you know, heaping all nations unto himself, you know, because the, the, the truth of the matter is the Heavenly Father is against that, you know. But he, he does that to, you know, you know, to uh, make people basically to go against the Heavenly Father. Whatever the Heavenly Father says, he does the opposite. And that's basically, you know what that covering cast represents, man. Okay. And the most highs put the spirit on his prophets to throw that shit in the garbage, man. Okay. That's why we, we, we strongly stress that we're not listening to the white man anymore. Okay. We, we've, we've listened to your lies and deceit for years and years, and we don't want to hear your counterclaims. We are just going to speak the truth of the Bible and, and the most high is going to come destroy him. That's it. Okay. Uh, verse eight, he will swallow up death and victory and the Lord Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, will wipe away tears from off all faces, and the rebuke of his people 
shall he take away from off all the earth for Yahweh have spoken it. OK, so that's the times we're coming into. And that's the reason why we hasten the day. OK, and people look at us like, you know, well, you guys are crazy. Why are you you with this doom and gloom? And why are you pushing for that? Yeah, because that entails us. Uh, what a reason. Verse eight. Uh, the most high will swallow up death and victory, meaning we will die and we will not die anymore. OK, and we don't have to be uh, subjugated to these heathens and we'll be set up in our kingdom. OK, that's that's what it entails. And the brother said the other night, man, we were sitting down talking. Why the fuck do you people not want to rule? Why do you you people don't want your kingdom, man? Speaking of you Negroes, Latinos and Native Americans. OK, and the ones of you that don't want it because you don't read and you don't study, you're going to be put to death, man. And that, that's that's the only only remedy, you know, because these niggas are, you know, just like they rejected the Messiah. They're basically rejecting their, their, uh, their kingdom, their rulership, their rest. OK, from their weariness. You know, so, yeah, but hey, the, 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 the scriptures are only for the elect of the nation of Israel. And as long as the elect of the nation of Israel get it, um, the rest of the nation can be saved. Period. Point blank. OK, so I'm going to read that again. Verse eight again. He will swallow up death and victory. And the uh, Lord, Yahweh, by Hashem, Shai will wipe away all tears from off all faces and the rebuke of his people shall he take away from off all the earth. For Yahweh have spoken it. And that's what we're waiting on. For the most high to take away our rebuke. Wipe our tears away. The ones of us that are crying and sighing. For the abominations that's done on the earth today. Okay. So hey brothers let's hold fast. Won't be long. Can't be long. Lord willing. Uh, so with that. Uh, I want to say. Yahweh Shemiah Shai. Wahal Rakal